the Whitney Stud Maiden is next. This is a mile and three quarter maiden for three year olds. At the top, they've got Crawler for Martin Hill, Dancing Rose for Satyam, Devilish Geld in Darren Thompson, El Paso Morant for Vinnie Gerard, Kin Elegance for Satyam, Late Arrival Craig Allen, Star of Norway Paul Rhodes, Trey Manor and Dernier Nosh for David Robertson, Drums in the Deep, Leon Van Rensburg, High Tap Town for Jim Murray, Lakota Sally, Padraig Hogan, and Swoop. For Joshua Sutherland, so 13 of them men. This time over the mile and three quarter trip. Oh, where they go? Oh, maybe some St. Ledger hopefuls in this. I hope you improve on their performance in the Maidens last week. But the Grey Kin Elegance has gone off into the lead for Satyam. And that one leads by a couple of lengths to Swoop in second. Crawler is in third. Horses appear to be in their right colours this time. And Kin Elegance is the leader. From Swoop in second, and then high top ten, and crawl up. Those three chase the leader about four lengths adrift of that grey. Kin Elegance is the leader, There's a gap of four lengths to the three of them. High top ten closest to us, and over on the far, or nearest to the far right, is crawl up. And between the two of them, Swoop. And back in fifth place is Devilish Gelding with the El Paso Marat. Wider, I switch to the other side of the track then now. And Kin Elegance is four or five clear. Of high top ten and swoop. Crawler is in fourth. And Devilish Girl in fifth later rival is making a forward move at the centre of the track and looking towards the back dancing rose. Here's the back marker. But it's Kin Elegance who's got the lead. By a good three to swoop, who's in second. High top town is third, crawler is fourth. Would have been pushed along that one. Bit of a gap then to let late arrival and drums in the deep. El Paso Marot and Tres Menor after that. And Star of Norway. Coach of Sally is quite wide on the track, and the two greys at the back are Dirty A Nosh and Dancing Rose. So it's Top and tailing greys at the moment. Satyam that's in the lead. I'm not sure whether Dancing Rose is Satyam or Padrags. A coat of Sally in front. Well, one of them will be. And it's Swoop in front. From High Top Town. So Swoop's gone on then net. And High Top Town is in second. Kin Elegance has just lost its place and dropped back a bit. So too is Crawler as El Paso Morant. Runs on into third now. Late arrivals coming through with a bit of a run. Devilish Guild and Star of Norway trying to get into as well. Suddenly, Swoop finds himself four or five lengths clear. There's only two furlongs to go, and it's Swoop in the lead. High top tone now coming down there. They throw down a really big challenge. El Paso Morant on the centre of the track. Then comes late arrival Star of Norway. Drums in the deep. Tremor all trying to run away. with a lot to do to catch this leader. There's a furlong to go, and it's high top ten. Who is clearing the lead by four and does not like he's stopping. In fact, he's pulling away, I think. The only one coming out of the pack is Star of Norway, but it's High Top Town in the lead, and High Top Town is going to take this goes with the High Top Town wins it easily. Star of Norway second out, pass out on swoop into the deep later rival Tremanor, all the way back to Crawler and Kin Elegance, right out of the back. And it's another one for Jim Murray. His good start of the season continues as High Top Town takes the one and three quarter mile three year old maiden that Whitney stood. And high top town for Jim Murray, the winner. Star of Norway for Paul Rhodes, second. El Paso Morant, Vinnie Gerard, third. Swoop for Joshua Thomas, fourth. And late arrival for Craig Allen, was fifth.